Number 34. Program your biocomputer. If you're a regular consumer of the major news programs, you belong to a very persuasive and hypnotic cult. You need to be deprogrammed. Start by altering how you listen to electronic radio gossip, the news, and shock and schlock TV shows. Program out all the negative, cynical, and skeptical thoughts that you now allow to flow into your mind unchecked when you hear the news. Headless woman found in topless bar. That was an actual headline in a daily New York City newspaper. I used to work for a city newspaper, and I remember how hard the editors in the newsroom would search for the most shocking stories they could find. The news is not the news. It is the bad news. It is deliberate shock. The more you accept it as the news, the more you believe that that's the way it is, and the more fearful and cynical you will become. If we realized exactly how much vulgar, pessimistic, and manipulative negativity was deliberately packed into every daily newspaper and most television shows and Hollywood movies, we would resist the temptation to flood our brains with their garbage. Most of us are more particular about what we put in our automobile's gas tank than we are about what we put in our own brain every night. We passively feed ourselves with stories about serial killers and violent crime without any conscious awareness of the choice we're making. How do we change it? By worrying about it? No. Rather than fretting about crime and apathy and whatever you wish would change in the world. It's often very motivational to heed the words of Gandhi, who said, you must be the change you wish to see. San Francisco writer and musician Gary Lachman wrote a captivating essay called World Rejection and Criminal Romantics in which he observed. It's the Ted Bundys that get television coverage, not the thousands of self-actualizers who work away at self-transformation quietly and anonymously. And it's their influence, not that of the Ted Bundys, that will shape the face of the coming century. Often we don't have an opportunity to skip the media reports of crime and scandal. So it's important that we listen in a way that always programs out the effect. We are pretty good at doing this when we pass the tabloids in the grocery store checkout line. We smile at them even before reading that aliens are living in the White House. We need to take that same attitude toward what passes as serious media. Once you've gotten good at factoring out the negative aspects of the media today, take it a step further, make your own news. Be your own breaking story. Don't look to the media to tell you what's happening in your life. Be what's happening. Thanks for watching. Are you visiting our channel for the first time? Then click subscribe and hit that thumbs up below the video. Join us for more videos like this.